we're making chewy sprinkle cookies for when you're completely out of chocolate chips but still have that cookie craving. Look no further, this is probably the cookie you're looking for. To get started, we need one cup of softened butter. I'm using salted butter even though the recipe calls for non-salted. And one and a half cups of sugar. We're gonna mix this until it's nice and fluffy. Next goes in one teaspoon of vanilla extract and two eggs. Give that a good mix and scrape the bowl as needed. As a side note, a list of the ingredients and directions are located down in the video's description box for your convenience. Next goes in the dry ingredients. We need one teaspoon of baking soda, two teaspoons of cream of tartar, and two and three quarters cup of all-purpose flour. Mix, mix, mix. Once everything looks good mixed in, grab your sprinkles. I'm going with this container of traditional birthday sprinkles. You can use non pearls if you want, the tiny little bead sprinkles, but in my opinion, these are a lot softer and don't have that earth shattering crunch you get with non pearls. Grab your cookie scooper, pretty sure this one's about two tablespoons worth. We're making big cookies here, no sissy cookies. Take your dough, gently roll it into a ball with your hands, and press it down into your sprinkles like so. You do not need to flip over your cookie and do the other side. You can if you want to, but it's not necessary. This one's sided layer will be plenty. You want to flatten your cookie ball into the sprinkles to about half an inch. Space out your cookies at least three inches as they will spread out during the baking process. Into a preheated oven at 400 degrees for 8 to 12 minutes or until the cookies have spread and are puffed slightly and do not look wet. Let your cookies sit for a few minutes before moving them to a cooling rack. Here's an ingredients list. Thanks for watching and be sure to subscribe so you don't miss out and I'll see you all in the next video.